Welcome to the VMware Integrated OpenStack product demonstration. In this video, we will demonstrate how to deploy an instance using the OpenStack Horizon interface. We start by clicking on the Instances menu on the left navigation pane, and then click the Launch Instance button to bring up the Instance Creation Wizard. On the Details tab, provide basic information about the instance, such as the instance name, flavor, OpenStack terminology for resource allocation such as vCPUs, storage, etc., instance count to deploy, and boot source. Boot source is generally an image, but it is also possible to boot from other sources. In this demo, we select to boot from an Ubuntu image. The Access and Security tab lets you access the instance via key pairs, security groups, and other mechanisms like TCP and UDP ports after an instance is launched. The who can access is determined by the key pair value, which represents either an SSH key entry to the instance's authorized hosts file or a PEM file. The security group setting governs which IPs can access your instance over which TCP and UDP ports. Click on the icon to add a key pair. Choose a key pair name that you can recognize later and paste your SSH public key under the public key space. Click on Import Key Pair. Under the Networking tab, select the network you wish the instance to use for communications. The Post Creation and Advanced Options tabs allow for further customization of the instance. The launch of an instance has completed successfully, and we can begin deploying applications on it. We can now observe how to create our instance from the command line using the boot command from the Nova CLI client. Let us look at the instances that are already running using the Nova list command. Next, we list out the elements that are required by the Nova boot command, including which key pair, network, and image to use. Note that we have enough information to use the Nova boot command to create a new instance. The task state and VM state indicate that our instance creation request has been processed successfully, and we can monitor the instance creation using the Nova list command. The launch of a new instance using the Nova boot command is complete. This concludes the VMware Integrated OpenStack product demonstration. Thank you.